Downtown businesses saw a lot of foot traffic come their way for the annual Slice of Chico event. Action News Now reporter Lauren Cooper checked out how the watermelon-themed sidewalk sale went this year. It's a bright, fun fruit, you know, easy to slice. It's the 48th annual Slice of Chico, and hundreds of people have come downtown for cut prices and cold slices. We have three pallets of watermelon. We are washing them all before we're serving them. Event assistant with the Downtown Chico Business Association, Adela Carrillo, told me those three pallets contain about 100 watermelons they'll be slicing up and serving to the community for free. Like I'm trying to get a lot of slices out because I know it's going to pick up. We're expecting like thousands of people, so okay. at least thousands of slices. And that's also thousands of people bringing in money to local businesses for this sidewalk sale event. It's been a while since I've been downtown and I've uh, kind of gotten into the whole spirit of the Chico thing, so I'm kind of like really enjoying this right now. We're going to try and go and maybe hit a restaurant up or something and just, uh, you know, have a nice relaxed Saturday, work hard all week. The event is also a big hit with the kids, like five-year-old Davin Jewett, who is really enjoying his slice. Can you tell me a little bit about the watermelon you're eating right now? How much do you like that? Mm, very much. But he's here for more than just the watermelon. Hey, what have you been doing out here today? The thing he was pointing to was the same thing four-year-old Malcolm Browning spent about half an hour playing on. I had so much fun. What was it like sliding down that? What? Have you had any watermelon today? Uh, no. You haven't had watermelon yet. Are you hoping to get some? Yeah. The watermelon themed event brought a lot more people out as the weather started to warm up. With a line of people trying to cool off with some ice cold snow cones. I'm Lauren Cooper reporting in Chico with Action News Now. Coverage you can count on. About 60 businesses had all kinds of sales, many of them being watermelon themed.